Hi guys and welcome to Heroes Quest and what's up? So we're going to make um we're going to farm I mean <laughs> our uh, fallen set so and also our <laughs> eclipse set because the spirit um illusion spirit drops illusion so that's why um my illusion set is like this plus ten and plus eight. My fallen um, armor set is I mean armor is plus two only so far weapon is plus three and our clock is plus two our fallen clock so that's it for the equipment and our attack set would be like this I already gotten the I have completed the shards so I got the gray shard tree now also um, I got the lightning from the illusion illusion spirit boss the thunderbolt this one so just informing you guys so we're going to check our skill tree what we're going to use on this um, uh, fight so I'm using my skill tree like this it's almost doesn't change <laughs> okay so my blessing is like this so I use the box oh and some new improvement I got this and remove this I remove the blacksmith too, since we're not going to farm for gold for upgrade we're going to farm drops so we don't need to upgrade our gear using gold so there's no blacksmith too resilience would be like this that's it for resilience so that's our skill tree guys now we're going to check our stats stats oops get out of here so stats um, I mean stats allocation so our stats allocation is like this there's no luck since we're going to farm uh, the drops item drops so we don't need uh, gold here so that's it and here we go um, before that um, first um, you need 58 energy and then swap to set 2 our set 2 is 1 book Set 3 is 2 book, 3 books, set 4, 5 is full book, all books, 6 is 3 books, 1 life still. Okay. So, set 2. And we're going to farm. You can also take this mobs, I mean boss, to increase your energy to plus 60. Or you, just, you can just skip it altogether. So what we're going to do now is going to farm um, our levels. Mm. Before our energy depletes to 50, we're going to swap to set 3 before we go we do battle. Before we're going to fight the mobs. So 48 energy, still good. 45 so we have scavenger here right plus two and then we're going to use um, the mage hero later so since the mage hero is low on stats compared to Sagittarius we, we really need to uh, increase our stats buff our stats for the mage later so that's what we're going we're doing now so we have full book and dirty energy it's to okay farm some more and then when we're down to 27 we're, we can fight na the boss now since our damage is 17 since our damage is 17 pointy we we don't need to change our set relic set to this this one one life still we can do full book all books on blossom tree Okay. 
and then we're going to use our attack setup our relic attack and we're going to hit this boss using Yggdrasil to increase our levels a little bit more and sometimes it drops um, eclipse set so you if you're lucky anyways we're going to swap to ethereal mage now and we're going to farm here the 2.1 m mobs and the 2.2 or the three initial digits if you want to fight the two uh, two point uh two mil uh, mobs just fight the 221 to be safe or 220 first initial three digits of the level of the mobs because sometimes you lose to 2.3 sometimes i mean 2.23 mil sometimes you lose there sometimes yes that's when the <laughs> mobs uh, the game will cheat you or in other words like um the evasion don't uh, trigger so that much so that's why you're going to lose <coughs> on the mobs so let's try the 2.26 see we're down to half our hp so it's better to uh, be safe just farm here hoping <laughs> Or drop we're using the hero um mage mm, because of i don't know maybe it affects the item drop of the treasure box sometimes it gives you um gold and you just need to repeat it new game i mean click equipment set to set one then new game okay and then sit set to uh, set to swap to set to and just repeat it guys so it's just like that do it like that so let's try our second run it usually gives drops either fallen or eclipse so either of the two is good so let's just farm our levels here swap to set 4 before our energy goes to 40 goes down to 40 Okay, swap for set 5 to set 5 full book and then the mobs uh, I mean the boss then we have 30 energy so we don't need to fight any mobs here uh, if you can if, if you want to you can still use the full book and fight the 1.77 or 175 or 177 I mean or 175 at least the first three initial digits anyway we're going to fight the boss the illusion spirit no drop and we're going to switch to mage again just farm the mobs here so that's what we're going to do here guys that's oh see sometimes we lose it really depends our, on, on our evasion even if we have a decent amount of damage and life we're still going to lose to this 2.20 that's 2.20 220 level <laughs> not even to 223 and we still lose so really it happens guys <laughs> it really happens you lose sometimes and there you go the drop so the mobs drop our eclipse we're just farming the eclipse here guys on these mobs to increase our um, stats it's also good to farm the eclipse here and we're hoping the game uh, the treasure box will drop the fallen set 
oh still nothing but still it drops guys so let's let's try again we might get our eclipse set to max doing this method We're just going. <laughs> Palpak. We're going to get energy here. <laughs> Since we waste a little bit of energy there. Or maybe you can do this, guys. Um, wait a minute. Since we almost killed the boss, the blossom boss. So that gives me an idea. maybe around 15 t our attack we're going to fight the boss hmm, that's 14 oops we for forgot to switch so that's 15 t our damage our attack stats so we're going to try the boss oh my god <sighs> never mind Last time, when we hit the boss, we have 11 T of attack and we almost defeated the boss. But now we have 15 T, it didn't break. It didn't. That's, that's crazy, right? 16 T are attack stats. That's crazy. But anyways, we're going to get another level just to be safe a little bit and get 175 here yeah. okay i'm going to switch to set seven or attack set and we're going to farm here again so hopefully we're going uh the treasure box will drop us and uh, the tra um the falling set so that's how we're going to farm the fallen set now guys uh, by treasure box so it's random so it's okay but it's kind of it, it's going to take longer but it's okay we can <laughs> we can max our <laughs> moon shard now so we have like um our attack is 2.95 with fallen plus 3 and we're going to swap to moon shard the eclipse weapon so we have more damage so we're going to use the moon shard to farm around here so hopefully we'll go we can max our <laughs> eclipse here so we're going to try 227 we're going to lose anyway so we're going to farm our <laughs> eclipse set here because we, <laughs> because we don't have any choice so final energy hope we get eclipse or fallen set not gold okay let's go to the next um equip set one new game um set switch to set two our relic and then use it brazil
we have 26.2 attack 26 tick why do we have 26 should be 28 we didn't change our stats allocation it should be around 28 or 2070 never mind we can still win okay we're just going to farm here the two mobs here and then the mobs over there we're not going um, down here we're just going to fight this one here the the mobs here that respawn uh, respawn here and the two mobs here so hope it's full and set oh okay we have <laughs> oh yeah boy let's go boy so <laughs> So that's how you go. So that's how you farm you. <laughs> We're aiming for the fallen, and the game gives us eclipse. Okay, that's how you farm the fallen set, guys. I am in the eclipse set. This video should be how to farm the eclipse set. I mean the video title. Maybe <laughs> I'll add that on the title. I haven't thought about the title so. <laughs> Oh my god At least it's an item guys Not gold right So it's still good Until it's Not good So maybe if we complete all the Eclipse set to max Maybe the treasure box Will have no choice But to give us up the fallen set so that's just a theory so i don't know we're going to see it now 